Hello and welcome. I'm the Autistic Modeler. Today, we're going to be building the 65 Chevelle Altered Wheelbase Funny Car Time Machine. Come on in, I'll show you the kit. All right, well, the nice folks over round two sent us over for a full build and review. So let's look at this box. Isn't that cool? It's like the old 60s artwork. I really dig this artwork because somebody actually drew this, and that's excellent work. Let's see here. On this side, this says the name. This side has some of the features here. And the wheels and another picture of the car. All right, let's open it up. Here we go. Look at that. All right. Wow, look at that body. Now, I've been told this is brand new tooling. This is not a uh, reissue of the original. This is brand new. It looks modern tooling to me. Nice and straight. Very nice. That altered wheelbase. Very cool stuff. And there's our clear parts. Comes with the red tail lights and the new modern installation type glass. And see, you can tell this is new tooling because the uniformity of the uh, plastic trees. There's our axle, our interior for our race. Here's the hood. Already have the hole cut out of it, so you don't have to do anything there. Racing dashboard, racing seats, and it has seat belts in there. That's pretty neat. There's the rest of our axle. And there's the chassis right there. The tubbed out chassis and our big Chevrolet engine it says 427. It's pretty neat, big block. Cylinder heads or steering wheel. And here's some ladder bars and the wheelie bars there. Steering, I guess part of the roll cage right there. And then here's the headers, more of the roll cage, I'm assuming. There's some wheel backs, parachute, blower drive belt, roll cage, some springs. It's like a starter there, distributor, cool stuff. And look at all this chrome. Those wheels are great. Front axles chrome, chrome valve covers, chrome blower stuff, intake. Neat stuff. I'm excited about this. This is great. And there's that. It's got an all new grill and front bumper. And then all your decal, um, not decal, detail stuff there. And then your blower piece and the oil pan. That's pretty cool. And look at these tires. No more plastic tires. It's got real rubber tires in it. These are Race Master Slicks. Very nice. And then here's the fronts, little skinnies. Really nice. No name on the fronts, but that's okay. And the other two. And it comes with this book here. It tells you their other products. Pretty cool. And then here's our decal sheet. Look at that. Neat stuff. I'm really liking this one. I think I'm going to go with something with using that. Neat stuff. You can do the box art or any way you like. So many options here. And then here's our book. Pretty basic stuff. Pretty cool. All right. Well, let's uh, make some decisions and figure out how we're going to build ours.
Well, it's that time again. That's right. Final assembly. Let's take a look what we got. Well, that body turned out excellent. Decals went on really nice. Nice parachute back there. Glass went in really well. Grill looks good. There's our hood, our rear bumper with our wheelie bars. Pretty neat. And then here's our chassis. Really nice engine. Really cool. Now, when I was installing the engine, I made a mistake. The book doesn't really say when to install it during assembly. So I built all this roll cage and I was like, uh, uh oh. So I had to pop off one side of the roll cage and kind of sneak it in there. So I would suggest putting the engine in before you put the interior tub and your frame rail runners in. That way it clears everything. So I made a mistake, but it really doesn't say in the instructions. So kind of was kind of a little confusing, but it went together great. Those wheels in the back are excellent. Came with dashboard decals. Neat stuff. All right, well, I'll pop this together and I'll be back in just a minute. All right, here it is, all finished. The 65 Chevelle Funny Car. This is a pretty cool kit. When I was doing the final assembly, the only thing I ran across, it fit really well, but where to glue the body to the chassis? Um, there's two points right here by the firewall you can glue it. And I used some light glue behind the rear window to the interior tub and then carefully placed it on there. But other than that, it went together really nice. Very cool kit. And here's the engine. There's the underneath. This turned out really well. I really enjoyed building it. It was fun. I really like those Chevelle-licious decals. That was really cool. This was a fun kit. And I want to thank Round 2 for sending it over for the full build and review. And I want to thank you guys for watching. And until next time, I'm the Autistic Modeler. Happy Modeling.